Oh, what a joy! A rescue squad! My comrades are all dead and I'm stuck here! Don't worry, lad. You're safe now. Tell me, I must know. Who are you? Do you have a unique ring? A glittering sword? A red cape? What? I'm... I'm a nobody, my lady. Please, don't hurt me. I used to be a cook, that's all. The War Council loves my chocolate cakes, but that's hardly a specialty. Really? We should change sides, Van Helsing. I insist. We will escort you to safety, soldier. You won't last alone out here. Did you see those weapons? Did you save Private Brian? Yes, we did. And I think I'm gonna have some words with the War Council. I wouldn't know anything about that. I suggest focusing on the defenses until we get Vlados back. Vlados is gone, and our defenses are crumbling. Our job is done here. In this case, we must return to the lair. You're right, Commander. But there are still civilians out there. Return to the lair and make sure it's ready to accommodate the refugees. I'll join the others and wait for the next attack.
That poor, mad Professor Fumigati piloted against us. If you mean the gigantic doomsday automaton that almost smashed me to a pulp, then yes, it was lovely. Great. Then you'll love the upgraded version, the Octopod Annihilator, even more. As far as I know, it's a gorgeous killing machine. And if we fail to stop it, it will destroy our defenses. is here again. What you have accomplished here is extraordinary, but there's nothing you can do now. The general has force domes everywhere, and he is moving in with the heavy artillery towards the foundry. That's it? We're running away? You are merely gaining valuable time until I do what I do best, seeking and hunting secrets, examining the occult depths of this land. And I'm the one who will find you a way to destroy those domes. Wait, did you just say I? So you know the personal pronoun after all. You are right, my lady. This one went too far and thought himself important. Enough. We'll go back to the lair to regroup. Move. As famous last stands go, the battle for Viaduct Junction was quite spectacular. Sadly, it doesn't change the fact that we are losing this war. I even had to leave behind important allies. General Harker is a worthy opponent. He has salvaged a mad scientist toy box, 
found some real treasures and used them wisely. Now the four stones are keeping us away from strategically important positions and the unnatural soldiers are forcing us back to the lair. Harker is on his way to occupy the foundries. The mysterious Prisoner Seven promised to find a way to destroy the domes. Until then, we must remain in the lair that the General is so desperate to find. So, we will have to keep him busy. Congratulations, Van Helsing. Great. What did I do again? Don't be ridiculous. That was an honest praise. I think you are a good commander. I'm still a better monster hunter. I've never said you were a great commander, but every beginning is difficult. I'm simply meeting a demand, you know. Would you like to earn some money? I've come up with a great little earner.
Sir, we found this strange ornithopter in the tunnels. We tried to shoot it, but it, well, it, it spoke to us. Turns out it's a messenger from an inventor called Telsa. He was captured by the general, but he rewired this machine and sent it for help. Great. So our associate mad genius is finally somewhere where he can't build anything that destroys half the city? You're not planning to set him free, are you? If he stays there, the General will eventually use his genius abilities against us. Will you send out a rescue team, sir? No, my friend. Rescue missions are my speciality. Do you have anything else to report? Yes, sir. Commander Petrov wants to have a word with you. Van Helsing, the War Council evaluated your actions during the siege, and they've decided to entrust you with the training of the elite soldiers. Wait, is this a punishment or a reward? And what exactly would be my task, Commander? You have to prepare the Resistance elite squads and send them out on important missions. We've appointed some new captains who will serve under your command. Meet them first, then choose wisely. Van Helsing, sir, reporting for duty. Easy, Captain. I'm still a monster hunter, not a general. What is your speciality? Ivan Zarevich reporting, sir. Special command tactics and offensive warfare. You must be one of those, ooh, muscles. I mean specialists. With muscles. Hmm. Nice day, isn't it, sir? Heard you were in charge now. We'll get along just fine. I used to be a hunter like you, Gregor Stark, Scourge of the Werebeast, at your service. Doesn't ring a bell. Sorry. But if you were a hunter, you must have a long list of useful expertise. Right you are, sir. Exploration is my middle name. And Ambush, Ambush is my other middle name. I also have an inkling of traps and ranged weapons. <laughs> Sorry. Actually, I'm great with traps. Is arrogance something they teach you at the Hunter's Academy? Wait, don't answer that. <laughs> Mr. Van Helsing, allow me. My name is Dr. Stoll. How are you feeling today? Are you a medical doctor, or a proper mad scientist? No, my lady, I treat no maladies. I'm a simple genius, born to defeat the world with giant exploding machines. Currently, I'm helping out the resistance. I'm also a diplomat, an expert on traps, and occult knowledge. At your service. Attention, resistance fighters. Testing the aerial transmitter. One, two, three.
This reminds me of my army days. General Harker has sent his soldier things down to the underground tunnels. They are still looking for the lair. They will eventually cut us off if we don't stop them now. That's the perfect opportunity to see our elite soldiers in action. They'll defend the tunnels. Another grim, reeking tunnel. You can't imagine how much I've missed this. Are you sure that this arrogant genius is worth the trouble? He might know a way to destroy the Force Walls. Or in any case, he could be a valuable asset to the Resistance.
passing. We need you in the tunnels immediately. wonder who does the maintenance work in these ancient tunnels? Honestly? No. But everything is so functional and deadly, and... Ah, uh, never mind. Good sir, I thought I was going to die in this prison. Speaking of prisons, can you spare some money for a man trying to fit back into society? Can't help, sorry. We Don't listen to her. Of course I can help you. Here's 100 gold. You are too kind, good sir. So I'm going to let you in on a little secret. There is a secret door in the next cell that leads to the secret holding facilities. They keep a lot of prisoners there, but the place is heavily guarded. I'm much obliged, Hunter. My wise decision to help you out last time really paid off. Although, you seem to be having some difficulties winning this war, don't you? You are remarkably judgmental for a rescued prisoner, aren't you? We need your help. Can you switch off Harker's force fields? I told you earlier that we had no tools to destroy those walls, and science hasn't really progressed much since then. I'm glad to aid your resistance with my genius, but I can't help you with that. I knew that it was a hunter's job. Fine. See you in the lair then. I'll find another way.
clever. A hidden prison inside a hidden prison. We have to go deeper. Not possible. That's so great. Back to the front lines. I can't do that. to the front lines. Now we can show Harker. Thank you, Van Helsing. Thank you, Van Helsing. Let me out. Oh, yes. I have to go. I'm having an old friend for dinner. I think we just made a terrible mistake. Now we can show Harker. Ah, let me 
out! I'm innocent! Somehow I doubt that. I'm a simple librarian with an addiction. Drank too much of Doctor... Everyone deserves a second chance. You can go. I hate freedom. I'm not worthy. I hate myself. I hate you. Die. Don't have enough mana.
Hunter, the secret libraries did hide a way to destroy the Four Stones. Although it could easily be a mission that proves to be impossible. Impossible missions are our main area of expertise. Should we choose to accept them? You need a force that could destroy the electrical barriers. And I found you the rawest power of Borgovia. High upon the Thunderhead Mountains, you will find Perun, the god of storms. He the sheer force of nature against science? Take us there. I'm going to set a storm guard against the forces of mad science. Well, that's Borgovia for you in a nutshell. While the Resistance is safely holed up in the lair, I'm leaving the city to find this Perun. Prisoner 7 is taking us to an abandoned part of the mountains, far beyond the reaches I've already explored. Our destination seems to be shrouded in mystery. The place has a nasty reputation. That's all I know. Even the professor avoided those peaks for some reason and removed it from the official maps. Prisoner 7 is oddly silent about this forbidden plateau, which makes me even more curious. It's time to do some exploration. Wait, what are we doing here? You were supposed to take us to the plateau. Do you expect me to walk all the way up? Katarina, could you just stop complaining about walking? This mountain once used to be the realm of Koshai, the Deathless, the most powerful being who ever lived in Borgovia. The place is still bursting with his dark magic. So it has become home for the mighty entities like Perun and his kin. And it's impossible to reach the peak by arcane means. Both of you must walk. Both of us? Aren't you coming with us? Your humble ally is too weak. The years he spent in Fulmigati's test chambers left him broken. And imagine how much help this man can be in Borgovia. Searching for the general's secrets. Good luck. I see you are still ignoring my advice about your mirror-faced friend. Why shouldn't I believe him? He's been helping us all the time. Why are you so trusting? Because he's also mysterious and wears a mask. Is there a club for the likes of you? Do you have a secret handshake? Enough, Katarina. Leave the man be. Those were some truly angry birds. Don't be such a pig. They're probably just protecting their eggs.
Look, I found a certificate from the Shadow Guild of Botanists, claiming that this man is a mushroom expert. I guess naming the guild uneducated didn't have the desired ring to it. So they went for a bigger word. Oh, 